Adventures and Events, speaking today with Carla Herte in uh, our fantastic Reservations Department. Now, Carla, today we're going to chat about something you brought to my attention, which is the number of people that have been calling you lately asking about where can I propose to my girlfriend? Where have you? What have you got that's kind of cool and neat in the Banff area to propose to my girlfriend? What um, you know, what sort of what sort of things are people looking for? What sort of tours are they looking for? Why are they asking you this question? Why not just do it old school over dinner? Yeah, that's uh, part of uh, what I've been asking myself. I've been receiving a lot of calls lately. Um, I think it has to do with just the buzz of the holiday season and, um, you know, leading up now to Valentine's Day, a month away, there's definitely the interest in uh, making a special proposal. And a lot of people are already booking their tours to Banff, especially around the holidays with their um, holiday time. Um, and with that comes the idea, hey, maybe now's the right time to propose. So definitely been receiving a lot of inquiries. In terms of why is it not just over dinner anymore, I don't know. I guess people are just getting more adventurous and wanting more of a wow factor. Well, and certainly Banff is a great place to do that. We, you know, There's lots of different adventures and tours for people to do in Banff. I know you've got three particular tours that seem to be your, uh, your hot three for romantic proposals. And uh, the first one that you mentioned to me was uh, going on a helicopter ride. What makes that special? That's right. Well, helicopter rides run year-round throughout Banff, so it's definitely um, an anytime activity, but we do offer a private charter, and that's been really popular lately in terms of proposals. Um, we actually take guests uh, two at a time, so it's usually, um, it can be booked for any reason. It can be just a romantic picnic, but again, lately it's been proposals. Uh, we board them up into a helicopter departing from Canmore. We do a 15-minute flight, which is um, typical to one of the other sightseeing flights we offer, um, which goes past the Mount Assiniboine Glacier, just southwest of yeah. Banff National Park. Fantastic. But instead of staying in air, the uh, the special part about the private charters, we actually stop for a half an hour at Marvel Pass, and you actually get to get out of the helicopter and use that time at your discretion. So, oh, um, what a great, uh, the view there must be spectacular right It now. is, yeah, you have 360 uh, mountain, view, mountain views, so it's beautiful. Gorgeous. Now that one's, uh, you know, definitely got some wow factor to it. I would imagine that would be a great way to make a make a great impression with your loved one. Exactly. Yeah. Now, um, yeah. Sorry, now the ahead. next one, the next one you talked about was uh, a sleigh ride, mm -hmm. and uh, that sounds like a great thing to do. Maybe something before dinner, or um, or you know after dinner, something maybe a little bit shorter time frame, but still obviously a very Canadiana type of thing to do. What can you tell me about that sleigh ride uh, tour that's been popular? The sleigh ride is very accessible. It actually departs right from the Banff town site. Um, and it's great for anybody who's a little bit tight on time, like you say, looking for an activity before or after dinner. It's about 45 minutes in length. And again, it's a private tour. So it is a couple's um, private sleigh. It's a two-person cutter sleigh. So it's just the, the special couple as well as a friendly driver. And we make that special, um, we make that tour special by including in the couple's package Bernard Calibo chocolate liqueurs, uh... an authentic buffalo robe. Um, what's nice about this is you don't necessarily have to be all outfitted in any special equipment. You really can just come dress warm for the winter time, but um, you know, in your fancy clothes if you're going out for dinner or just right. coming from. Exactly. Now, what is a? Did you mention a buffalo robe? Mm -hmm. What is a buffalo robe? Well, like you said, Canadiana. We actually, uh, <laughs> being obviously that it's a sleigh ride, it is horse drawn. Um, we uh, definitely bring in some of the Western touches to that. So the oh, buffalo cool. robe is exactly that. It's actually the fur of buffalo that uh, keeps you warm. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Now the last one, the the third one, you know, definitely is a Canadian type tour, and that's dog sled tour. And I know dog sledding has been incredibly popular here, especially in the last four or five years. And I can imagine that would be a pretty neat way for someone a little more adventurous uh, to do. You know, your girlfriend might expect something if you're out on a sleigh ride together or going out on a helicopter for any reason, but uh, Dog sledding is certainly a different thing to do. Now, what makes that one so special as far as a place to propose on? Well, basically, the dog sled tour itself is is one of those once in a lifetime experiences. Um, getting to behind, getting to be behind the sled of you know powerful huskies, purebred huskies is just amazing. So, what makes that one special is that typically we offer the sleds at three people per sled. Um, but when it is used for a special occasion such as a proposal, we do have our gold package, which uh, ensures that it's just two people. Now, the, the trail itself that, uh, on one of the ones we use is 10 kilometers, and that actually takes us to a secluded pond. And once we stop at that pond, we have warm refreshments and cookies, and it's the perfect time to just go for a walk, take some pictures, and 
pop that uh, special question. Yeah, I bet. I imagine the the musher would be more than happy to take a photo of uh, the lovely couple once you're You got there. it. Yes, for really all nice. three tours, the guides and drivers, they're more than happy to get involved. We often have special requests such as, you know, can you make the place stop or can we hang a sign from a tree or, you know, will the uh, helicopter pilot take photos for me? And yes, we uh, we're always happy to help out in any way we can. Excellent. Well, Carla, how can uh, how can people get a hold of you and your team to, to ask some more questions and, and make their booking for something special like this? How can they get a hold of you? Well, we'd love to hear from anybody interested. Uh, you can call our Adventure Reservations Department. The phone number is 1-800-565-8735, extension 2. Or if email is easiest, uh, we also answer emails daily at reservations at canadianoutback.com. Wonderful, Carla. Thanks for all the information on these great proposal ideas up in Banff. And uh, we're looking forward to uh, making some memories with people. Perfect. Well, hopefully we'll hear from people soon. Excellent.